as teenagers, um, we sort of hung out in groups, and based on fraternities or sororities you were in. And so um, one group would always hang around where the Avondale's was, and another group would hang around where the Chinese restaurant was. And then sometimes they'd switch over to the other side of, you know, uh, where uh, the drugstore was, um, and that was Kennedy's at that time. And so, growing up on, on and thinking about the Main Street, I always thought about how these two groups interacted. And it wasn't like, you know, gangs, it was just that they're just two different types of, of, of groups that, you know, if they were partying, they would mix it up or not. But, but it, it wasn't like, uh, you know, well, if you're over there, don't you come over here. But, but just people would gravitate to these two different groups. And I think that's the one thing that stands out for me on, on uh, the Main Street. Um, I guess I guess the people who hung around the uh, Chinese restaurant, like the Club Nineteen, and, and were considered more the the rougher, tougher kind of group. <laughs> and fraternities used to play a, a pretty big role back then because, you know, I guess depending on which fraternity you were in, you were considered a certain type of person. You know, whether you're a, a jock or whether you're a party kind of fraternity. Um, the same with like I think there was maybe two girls fraternities. So. I don't, I don't know, I, 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 I guess you're being labeled, eh, by being in, in certain fraternities. And geographically too though, I mean there was uh, um, the people who lived in town and then and then people who would come in from the farms and so you know, so that was another group that would come in and, and you know, I'm, I'm going back to probably when I was in high school um, and if I remember correctly, you know, we, we probably had about 15, 1600 kids in Niagara District. So you can imagine, you know, um, on a summer weekend or even just on the weekends when, when everyone would just come down to the main street and then from there, you know, find little parties or, you know, just find things to do. So there's quite a, quite a group hanging around on the main street and, you know, it's, it's quite funny, you know, like today I walked uptown to get to the mail and it's like, you don't see anybody, you know, it's like. Like you go uptown now, even when it's nice, you you don't see anybody that you really know. Like like you don't see kids hanging around. Um, I don't know. It's just so different now.